Hey, Coach. Congratulations on another win. What's happening, on Sarge? Oh, nothing much. Um, I wanted to ask you about Kevin Gailey. I mean, he led your team in assists in the first half, and then in the second half, he led your team in scoring. Uh, he's your, uh, as far as percentage-wise, your best three-point shooter. I mean, what has he meant for this team all year? I mean, he was out for a while to begin the year, but he just seems to be getting better with each game. He's, uh, he's a great person, Lashard. Honestly, he's uh, one of the most coachable players that I've been around, um, you know, at this level. Um, obviously, being a uh, former draft pick and um, being with us, he's an unbelievable person. And I, I honestly think that's uh, one of the reasons why um, he, he is where he is. Um, he takes coaching from me and my assistants. Uh, he listens to his teammates. He, he absorbs the feedback. And um, but he puts himself in position because he's got a good work ethic. Um, and that's why he's shooting the ball. I'm not sure where he's going to be at right now, but I know he's at 48%. So he's always going to look at me when I tell him that he needs to uh, limit the shots <laughs> from behind the three. He's, uh, he's our better shooter. So I might have to, uh, I might have to space him and tell some other guys to cut and put pressure on the rim. So, um, but he's been unbelievable. Like you said, I mean, last night he had 14 rebounds. Tonight he leads us in scoring uh, four for six from three. So uh, he's just showing how talented he is. And uh, one more question on the defense. You're able to hold them under 100 points. I mean, being able to hold any team in the G League under 100 points, I mean, I'm sure as a coaching staff, you have to be, like, really proud of your defense, especially how it's improved throughout the year. For sure, of course. Uh, that's always the goal, as you guys know, uh, from day one. Um, but we always want to keep them under 100, uh, and that's the goal, and the guys know it, and uh, they did a great job of uh, finishing the game off. Thank you, Coach. Appreciate you, Lashard. Great. Hey, Coach, uh, good evening. Uh, it seems like your team is slowly trying to recover back and getting players back from injury. Tonight, you got a little bit of production of Khalil Whitney. Uh, what does this mean for your team just uh, moving forward as you're going to get more guys uh, recovering and hopefully you guys will be able to have at least be at full strength uh, to close out the season? Yeah. Yeah. Um... You know, that's no, number one thing is health, um, keep everybody healthy. And then number two, just, you know, making sure everybody's on the same page uh, going into the playoffs. So um, hopefully, you know, uh, Vital will uh, be back healthy coming up, uh, Trevor and Queen. Um, so, and then, you know, hopefully get Knicks and who knows, maybe some other guys and uh, give uh, Coach Mahmoud a little gift going into the playoffs. <laughs> And the last one from me, Coach, uh, you were talking about Kevin Gale and, and how much of a difference he's been for your team. But as a coach, and you said he's coachable, he's workable with, what, what's been the overall progress of him uh, during this second half of the season now that you've been able to set him up with the uh, like direct screens, him working on his outside shot and basically leading your team in, in the outside range shooting? Um, once again, I mean, he's continues to develop uh, from day one. Um, once he got to RGV, you know, we sat down and had a good conversation on his role, you know, what will help him progress and, uh, you know, be at the next level. And everyone wants to see him just consistently, you know, what he can do around the rim. Uh, but he's expanded his game. And, you know, I trust me, I've, I've had a number of uh, NBA scouts just reach out um, asking just about his shooting and it's it's proven uh, it's not like it's something that's just over a short span of three to five games uh, he's done this since he's uh, come back from injury over the last two months and he's shooting the ball at the high at a at a very high level and I would love to compare him just to to other players in the league and not just at his position but I'm sure he's shooting it um, at an elite level right now so good for him and good for us Casey. thank you coach Thank you, buddy.